Because in a sensational statement, Nagaland Pradesh Congress Committee President K. Theory today claimed that there was no point of forming a core committee for talks as it has already concluded in Nagaland. He also added that the entire exercise will only be a waste of time and money. In another direct attack on the state government and the rebel groups, Theory added that the only purpose of setting up a core committee was to save the government's image. That government is a party to government of India. I think they have taken oath very clearly under Article 3. So when state government is a party to go I mean government of India, why? What is the necessity of forming this government? If the state government, the governor, governor is the head of the state, they function under the pleasure of the governor. So they should support, they should agree with the governor, but they are now in contravention. Governor and state assembly, they are in conflict. This is a funny thing happening here in the state for the first time. I don't, I don't feel the state government is actually want, wanting any solution. They are only protecting their chair. For Nagas of Nagaland, the seven, eight MPGs, the stakeholders of uh, Nagaland GBS Federation, tribal halls, political parties. Everybody wanted solution that we have expressed clearly to governor. So why should the state government say one solution? Continue resume to talk. They are asking to resume to again talk. After having concluded that, if the state assembly is asking to resume the talk, what is the logic? And earlier in the day, Theory and Heads' delegation handed over a memorandum to the governor over rising fuel prices in the state.